most people would turn you away. I don't listen to a word. was quite a touching performance. I mean, you dedicated to your sister, but you know the song is about a rat, right? I know. Your, your sister is like a rat? No, no, she's just very cute. Like mouse like that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so she is. A rat is a big mouse. <laughs> okay, the, uh, very nice performance. I, I want you to be careful with your, your words. Alright. You kept saying ban. Ben, ben, too. Yeah. Okay? Mm. Ben. Ben, okay. Okay. <laughs> Noro, my music uh, journalist colleague in today's Today paper says, uh, identified you as the weakest link and he said you were very, you were the least comfortable and least enthusiastic. Mm -hmm. I was very worried for you tonight because you did two gimmicky songs in a row and I thought, hmm, he might be right. I'm going to have to call him and disagree. I think you deliver that very comfortably. Thank you, Florence. Thank you. Noro, what, what kind of a singer do you want to be? I was about to say when you grow up, sorry. <laughs> what kind of a singer do you want to be now that you have grown up? Uh, obviously, I want to be a great singer who can eat the thin crowd and they can feel me, you know, through my moves and my soul inside. Okay, now mm -hmm. my question to you, do you think you're projecting that message to the audience? Yes, definitely, yes. But I do not feel that, you know. I mean, you, you sound good. All right. I'm just trying to figure out what is the problem here. I mean, is it because you are just not very confident about your stage presence or what? I'm unsure about it. Okay, I think you, ha you, you, have to, you have to know what you are doing on stage because really you, sound good. you sounded good. In fact, today you sounded quite good. But I still cannot see that star quality in you and that's very disturbing. All right? Okay, okay no rule, everybody. It's not too bad. Right? We see you with a good voice, you sang well today. Just to start well, just to bring out more. Just relax and yeah. enjoy more, right? Yes. You enjoyed Nuru? So if you did, then there's only one thing left for you to do. Vote for her. Number is 1-900-112-1203. Or you can SMS the number 3 to IDOLS. Nuru, everybody. We go for a break. We come back with Sylvia, Charles, Tabitha and more MJ Hits. Stay tuned. Welcome back to Singapore Idol Live. As a solo artist, Michael Jackson recorded 10 albums and had 13 hit singles. So naturally doing a Michael Jackson cover is no easy task, as our next contestant, Sylvia, will tell you all about that. If you know me for a while, after I get warm up to you, you will know that I'm quite a bit of like a space bunny. And I heard about um, the, the theme being Michael Jackson. I was excited, but at the same time, I was also kind of nervous because Michael Jackson, he transcends all category. He is not rock or he's not pop. He's just Michael Jackson. I pick the way you make me feel because that's one of the greatest hits from Michael Jackson. I want the audience to feel Michael Jackson's passion for the song. If I have one minute with Michael Jackson, I will kiss his gloved hands and then his shiny shoes.
you, you've been doing all kinds of different genres, and actually, basically, whatever you do, you seem to do quite well. <laughs> you, you seem to tackle any style quite well. So I thought that was um, just, but tonight it was a little bit of a okay, Oni. Yeah, because um, I feel that you're losing the fire. You're losing it. I don't know what it is. I want you to really pick that up and really give it. That was not 100% from you. I didn't feel that. Okay, thank I you. I felt it before, so I know, you see. It's okay. about 70%. The 70%? Yeah, not good enough. Okay. I think vocally, um, Sylvia, tonight you did not nail it. And at some points of the competition, I was even doubting whether you would make it to top 10. But I can tell you something, as a performer, not only have you blossomed, you've just burst out and become this star. So, I don't think you're in any danger tonight, and I just want to say, welcome to Top 10! Thank you! You know, that was a difficult song to sing. Yeah. But let me ask you something, Sylvia. Um, did you believe me when I first told you during your first auditions that you would be amongst the Top 10? No. Alright. Now, was it pressurizing not to let me down, and did that pressure help you to reach this stage? Yes. Okay, good. You know, when you compete commercially, right, your success is dependent upon the expectations of the consumers. Out of the thousands of contestants that have taken part in this season's idol competition, I think you came closest to delivering of what's expected out of you. Okay. All right? Now, I'm going to give you more pressure. You will be in the top four. <laughs> Silver, everybody. Sylvia, I'll still talk for, okay? okay? Pressure is on. Pressure is on. But the only way she can get there is if you, Singapore, help her. You have to vote for her. The number is 1-900-112-1204. Okay, that's the number. Four to I-D-O-L-S. The voting lines are open. Sylvia, everybody. Thank you. Now, Michael Jackson was a fantastic singer, dancer, but he also was a master beatboxer. And who better talk about that than Mr. Beatbox himself, Charles. I guess one thing similar about me and Michael Jackson is that we are a bit misunderstood. For example, whenever I'm very relaxed, right, I tend to look very serious. Okay, but when I try to look relaxed, uh, that's when uh, you know I'm thinking a bit too much about it. So it's a bit funny, uh, so I hope you guys don't misunderstand. So yeah. Plus, uh, he also can beatbox, which is uh, something I found out quite recently. He will just think of whatever beats and grooves comes to his head. And straight away, like a tape recorder, he'll just say it out in beats. I'm gonna do uh, Remember the Time. So uh, I'll be adding some beatboxing to it, so I hope you guys will enjoy it.